The processor is at the center of everything on your computer. It's the brains of the operation. And in order to build a solid gaming computer in 2021 and beyond, you're going to need a quality CPU. While some games like first-person shooters are heavily dependent on your graphics card, other games like RTS and MMORPGs have more calculations that need to be carried out and therefore utilize your processor much more. This should factor into your decision whenever looking for the best gaming CPUs for your build. Welcome to another video of Disrupt Tech, where today we're going to be telling you about the top 10 best budget CPUs which you can get without breaking the bank. But before we get into that, make sure that you drop a like on this video, subscribe to our channel, and ding that notification bell as well. Number 10. The Intel Pentium Gold G5400 If you're looking for a general all-purpose GPU and you really don't want to spend a lot of money, you can hardly do better than the Intel Pentium Gold G5400. Now, you might be surprised to hear that name Pentium these days with all the core branded chips on the market, but the Pentium brand still has some life in it. While still only a dual-core processor, the Pentium Gold G5400 does support hyper-threading and a clock speed that is rival to the Core i3. For everyday home or office use, this processor is more than adequate and, for the almost obscene price point, it's impossible not to recommend it as it's one of the best cheap processors out there. You can get this CPU for around $170. Number 9. The AMD Ryzen 3 3100 this budget-oriented CPU option for gamers is AMD's Ryzen 3 3100 series. Like the Intel Core i3-10100, the Ryzen 3 3100 is perfect for gamers who are working with a tight budget. When combined with a budget graphics card, the Ryzen 3 3100 is capable of delivering excellent performance on a 1080p monitor. And unlike the Intel Core i3-10100, the Ryzen 3 3100 can be overclocked. The one downfall of the Ryzen 3 3100, though, is that it has been tough to find in stock online since its release. If you do end up finding it in stock, it is perhaps a better option than the i3-10100. Either option is great for their price range, though, and you can get this CPU for around $224. Bucks. Number 8. The Intel Core i7-3770 The Intel Core i7-3770 quad-core processor is a pretty decent model for gaming. It can handle games at an incredible FPS to be able to get you to a dependable resolution. The CPU features four cores and eight threads, meaning that it can handle multitasking jobs. It's even equipped with remarkable HD 4000 integrated graphics that you can work off of if you're not looking to add a dedicated GPU. The processor features a clock speed of around 3.4 GHz and does have a turbo boost up to 3.9 GHz. The CPU is similar to the i7-3770K, except for the unlocked multiplier feature on the i7-3770K. The Intel i7-3770 plays right into the hands of gamers. Why? Well, it just goes to show that even with a top-end GPU, you can still get a lot of performance on relying solely on a CPU. It does help gamers on a budget not to have to upgrade everything to a new processor just to reach higher speeds and improved resolution. This budget beast can end up being bought for $193. Number 7. The AMD Ryzen 5 2600 Another great value option from AMD's now legendary Ryzen lineup is the vulnerable Ryzen 5 2600. The CPU was also a really popular CPU a couple of years ago, and it's still a viable option for a budget-oriented gaming machine. The Ryzen 5 2600 is based on the older Zen Plus architecture, which does have slightly slower cores than most of the CPUs listed here, but it's still a good performer in most games that are out there today. The R5 2600 is a 6-core 12-thread processor with a clock speed of 3.4 GHz and a boost clock of 3.9 GHz. What is great about the R5 2600 is that it can handle most productive tasks really well thanks to its 6 cores and 12 threads. Its gaming performance is a bit behind the Ryzen 5 3600 and even the 3300X, but in comparison, the R5 2600 can be found for quite a lot cheaper. You can pick this guy up for a $168. Number 6. Intel Core i3-8100 One of the best performing CPUs in this roundup 
The Intel Core i3-8100 is a truly stupendous budget gaming CPU. It outperforms the Ryzen 3 1300X in both multi-threading and single-threading performance, despite both chips having four physical cores and four threads. That makes this CPU one of the best budget gaming CPUs in the market. This CPU will couple well with the GTX 1050 Ti and it could even be paired with a top tier GTX 1060 without any issues. It is great for gaming in addition to some other workstation tasks such as video editing and multitasking. For the price, it's a wonderful all-around processor. This budget beast can be grabbed for $169. Number 5. The AMD Ryzen 3 3200G if you're working with an extremely tight budget and you don't have enough to fit a decent processor and graphics card combination into your build, then you can always, always opt for AMD Ryzen 3's 3200G. The 3200G combines both a solid CPU and GPU all into one chip, allowing you to forego the cost of a dedicated graphics card. The 3200G is strong enough to run most of today's top games on at least lower settings. In fact, with a budget of just $300, you can build an entry-level gaming PC with the Ryzen 3 3200G that will allow you to run games like Rocket League and League of Legends with no problems. So even if you don't have a lot of money to spend, the 3200G gives you the option to be able to build an entry-level gaming PC now. This CPU will cost you around $210. Number 4. The Intel Core i5-7500 the Intel Core i5-7500 is aimed at newcomers who are looking to build a gaming rig from scratch. It offers significant features for building a new gaming PC compared to upgrading an existing rig. It's not unlocked for overclocking, which is why the i5-7500 isn't suitable for more advanced games that would require superior overclocking. The CPU reaches a boost of 200 MHz with 4 cores and 4 threads with at least 6 MB of L3 cache. The unit also has a TDP rating of 65 watts, which is a great feature because it does mean that you're not going to need to buy an extra cooler. The 14 nanometer manufacturing process allows the CPU to run far higher frequencies without increasing its core voltage. The CPU uses Intel's Turbo 2.0 technology, and the high speeds are sufficient for a CPU to be able to keep as a gaming competitor. As a result, the i5-7500 LGA 1151 7th generation integrated Intel HD graphics offer a base frequency of 350 MHz that can reach one whole gigahertz. The unit also offers DirectX 12 support, Intel Enhanced Speed Step, and activated virtualization. The processor can get integrated with modern gaming PCs without becoming the bottleneck. The Intel Core i5-7500 manages to produce 26.5 FPS at 1080p for the most demanding of games. This CPU can be purchased for $160. Bucks. Number 3. Intel Core i5-10-4100 Another solid CPU option if you're looking in the budget range is the Intel Core i5-10-4100. The Intel Core i5-10-400's direct AMD competitor is the Ryzen 5 3600. Both processors will work well for gaming and in multi-threaded applications. However, the Ryzen 5 3600 is slightly better because of its ability to be overclocked, and the better CPU cooler that does come with it. The i5-10400 is a bit cheaper though, and if you don't plan on overclocking and you don't mind using the Intel stock cooler for the time being, it's a pretty decent option. Ultimately, both processors will perform similarly in terms of in-game performance. This CPU can be found for around 238 bucks. Number 2. AMD Ryzen 5 1600 The addition to the Ryzen 5 1600 has helped AMD rebuild its image over the last several years. Part of the reason why this is, is the AMD Zen architecture. The model features 6 cores and, universally, unlocked ratio multipliers. The CPU is built to deliver high frame rates and can tackle up to 40 frames per second on average. The processor can also provide up to 60 frames per second whenever tested with 1080p games. It's not on the high end of CPUs, yet you cannot argue that the processor underperforms either. The Ryzen 5 1600 is designed with a variable clock speed of between 3.6 GHz and 4 GHz. It can go higher when you pair it with a more capable cooler like the Wraith Spire. 
Otherwise, you don't have to worry about what the latest game can do to its temperature as it can control itself to not overheat. You can grab this CPU for 160 bucks. Lastly, number one, Intel Core i5-11600K. The Intel Core i5-11600K is beloved by many new Rocket League generation players, which marks a nostalgic return to the old days of the Intel CPU launches. The top processor was always a decent Halo product, but the i5 is where the price and performance metrics had really sold for a new generation. The 11600K is an outstanding 6-core 12-thread gaming processor, plus it is incredibly affordable too with a price tag that is well underneath the Ryzen 5 5600X and performance figures that have a trading blows with AMD's otherwise excellent Zen 3 chip line. The Cypher's Cove 14 nanometer backport may have made it rather power hungry, but that still doesn't stop it from being a great gaming CPU and one that does deliver a lot of processor silicon for not a whole lot of cash. Currently, it is one of the best budget gaming CPUs around, and you can get it for around 215 bucks. So, what do you think about these budget CPUs? Which one of them do you think offers the biggest bang for your buck? And are there any budget CPUs that we miss which should have been on our list? Let us know what you think in the comments section down below, and before you leave, make sure that you've subscribed to our channel and ding that notification bell so you never miss another update from us. Until next time, folks, we'll see you later.